So uh, someone asked, you mentioned OCR. What's the difference between an OCR complaint and state complaint? Pain. Lots and lots of pain. So in 2021, I filed 29 due process hearings in Texas. This is one of a handful of states that I'm allowed uh, to interpret state and federal special education law without being a litigator, and I do that. Um, And while I like uh, the mechanism of state filing, it's quite expensive. It's about $30,000 for families. Uh, If you get an attorney, I am not an attorney. Attorneys graduate college. Um, um, I find the OCR currently to be the most effective uh, branch of um, our six dispute resolution options. The OCR, however, is like a pregnancy takes a while and you have to have clients that have time to wait for that. Um, But the impact I find is much more permanent because it's the federal government. Um, So we have 11 um, uh, um, OCR offices in the United States and they govern a handful of states and um, they're not the good old boy systems in Alabama or Missouri or Washington or Texas. Um, You have to know how to um, file effectually with the OCR And you have to know how to overcome their questions in an interview because you're being interviewed and questioned by federal attorneys. 